Hi everybody, uh, this is Bruce. So I have a interesting dilemma here. I'm inside of a, ooh, I want to say 1980 Chevy Scottsdale and we have a voltmeter hooked up on the dash. And you can see the battery voltage, resting voltage is, you know, it's, it's, it's in the green. But basically, the voltmeter is telling everybody here that this this thing, the battery voltage is working. The gauge is working. All right. So the phenomena here is that this uh, engine and wiring in here will start charging with only the charging wire hooked up on this 10SI alternator. Uh, I want to be sure it's a 10SI, but it looks like it. It might be a 12. I don't know. I don't see the, the webbing back there, the, the holes for vents. Anyway, without the, without the um, field, you know, the sense wire and the field wire, this thing still operates. And I don't believe this is a one wire alternator. Anyway, I'll show you. Pull the choke, add the gas, and the battery. We want something here. But it's interesting because I haven't done it in a while, but it will. Okay, now watch this. So now it's charging overcharging and there is no sense wire there is no field wire I don't know why it's doing it see watch it is working it's working you can hear it roaring I don't know but it doesn't no matter which alternator you put in there too 